hawthorn here flowering in the end of May. Hawthorns are really diverse genus, Cretaceous. There are somewhere between 200 and 1,000 species of hawthorn in North America. Botanists aren't really sure. They uh, hybridize freely, all these different species, and there's so much variation. The leaves of hawthorn are always, at least from what I've seen, very serrated, highly toothed, and the fruits that come after these flowers are done are really variable. I'll let this car go by. Sometimes the fruits taste horrible, and sometimes they taste really, really good. They're kind of like little tiny apples for the most part. And sometimes they get diseases just like apples, and sometimes they're very clean. Sometimes the fruits hang on all winter. Sometimes they are done by early, early fall or end of summer. We collect hawthorn berries for making medicine. It's very good for your heart and circulation among lots of other things. Plus, sometimes they just taste really good. They're great wildlife trees, and some of them are super thorny. They don't get very big. Most hawthorns are just like little tiny, like a small apple tree kind of thing. Some of the thorns are fierce. Let's see if we can walk in and see the trunk. There we go. Here's a typical hawthorn. That's why they call it a hawthorn. Those are nasty. You don't want to poke yourself with, a, with one of those or step on one of those. But there's the hawthorn. Many, many different types of species. Many insects, diseases, and animals love this tree. I hope you do too. Thanks for watching.